Hello and welcome to episode 97 of my Two Worlds 2 tutorial Let's Play series. This episode is going to be on starting and hopefully finishing the quest Obsession which I was given in, at the end of the last episode um, by Ta, Tai Lin um, so I now need to do that and that's what we'll be doing. I'm right outside his house so as all I have to do is walk inside do you think? This is quite a collection. My father was a neurologist. Not by trade, it was only a hobby. When he died, my mother couldn't bear to part with him. But she also couldn't bear to look at them either. Thus, they became my inheritance. What does this have to do with me? Sometimes I have strange dreams. And when I wake up, my father's clocks are next to my bed. I can't explain why, but they're always running. The first time it happened, one of my fellow students dropped dead in class. They said it was an allergic reaction to the mushrooms in our school lunch. I thought it was only a coincidence at first, but then other people started dying. Every time a clock was at my bedside. It happened again this morning. You think the clocks are connected to your mother's death? Not all of these devices measure in hours. Some are graduated for days, even weeks. And each one in this room has been at my bedside at some recent point. All lives waiting to be taken by some dark magic. I can feel who's marked on the streets when they pass by, like a sixth sense. My dreams are terrible. Does this have anything to do with the reason you were expelled? No, I couldn't make fireballs, and that's why they kicked me out. But this... This is something else. Come, there's more to see. Okay, follow Ty Lin to the next room. What are these clocks that he's talking about? I can't see any... Oh, egg timers. Maybe. Yeah, egg timers. I believe this is Professor Canis, the most powerful mage in New Ashos. I've heard of this Professor Kanan. Most people have. I mean, many still hold him responsible for the destruction of the original campus. Still, he's the best teacher I've ever had. I just can't watch him die and do nothing to try and stop it. You're sure the hourglass is his? Dreams do not lie. I'm getting the impression this isn't as random as you first made it sound. We don't always remember our dreams. Usually I don't, unless I write them down. The one about Kanif was one I had the foresight to record, so yes, in a way, there is a prediction involved. Why don't you tell him what's going on? I'm not allowed on campus, remember? Expelled students are not just cut off from enrollment, they lose their association completely. I suppose I could write him a letter, but I'd have no way to deliver it. You want me to do it? I was thinking that, yes. You'd have to give it to his assistant. The professor is a very difficult man to get in touch with. I haven't agreed to actually do this yet. You don't work for free, I understand. You're a man of the coin. But I assure you, I will have the funds to pay you by the time the errand is complete. Write a letter, and I'll take it to Kenneth. I already have it ready to go. Tell them it's a magic scroll that needs returning. And it may increase our chances of Kenneth actually reading it. Here. Deliver the scroll to Hay the female help. Um, now I did clear out a lot of the junk in my pocket. Well at least what the game would allow me to clear out. Scroll for Kenneth. So it's that one there. Right, okay. Let's have a look at the quest log. Tyling gave me a scroll warning on its first page that Kenneth's death was imminent. I should give it to Hai, Hai, the help lady who used to be Kenneth's assistant, and see if she will pass it on. And also, I think I've got the main quest to s yeah, see that linked to that Kenneth, um, but they're going two different directions. This one's going to his assistant so that's where we're going to go if I double click 
so I'm here and I've got to go there near that shifty stranger which I'm going to kill this time because he keeps asking me for money um, but you got, I've got to be careful I can't cast my fireball because it's area of effect and it'll hit the shopkeepers and then I'll be attacked by all the guards anyway let's go and finish this quest obsession so I've got to go to the right Oh, is that goodies? What's this? Yeah, nice. Ooh, locked. That's a big arm, big um, egg time. So it looks like the sand's all run out, so you should be dead by rights, but never mind. So we've got to go back into the town. So that dragon's den is that blue cross there. And the assistant should be down there. Yeah, there's the blue cross. Now this shifty stranger who is going to depart this world if he tries to get more money out extortion more money out of me looking good cupcake <laughs> what now you're going to have to cough up some more dough I need about 250 auras right you call me cupcake so I think it's time we settled this like men we settled this like men men You don't even know what a man is. Bring it on. You know what this means. It was your job to collect them from the students. I'm so sorry. Where's the scroll? I don't know. Listen to me. Master Kanit is asking questions. We need to find it. Now. I'm so sorry. This isn't just our jobs at stake. It's our entire careers. Good job he doesn't hit for much. Oh, he has got my health down. I need to heal. Right, look, my weapon is not equipped. Stay away from that guard. Get to healing. And better get more mates. There, he's gone. But he's quite tough. So that was why it's best to get rid of him. Sir, he's kind sir. Looking for work? Oh, for goodness sake. I want to get the quest, but... Oh, excellent. You look like a hard worker. I'm Fluvia, sole proprietor of Umbrella Heaven. New Asho's finest purveyor of parasols, fashionable rain gear, and protection from the elements year-round. Sounds like a lucrative business. You have no idea. Magic may keep some people dry, but the rest of us have to do what we can. The umbrella is the most useful invention since the telescopic lens. And yet most people don't even know it exists. That's why I'm out here, in public, promoting my product. It's not always easy. In fact, right now I have need of some under-the-table employment. A contract position, if you will. The job. Promise not to laugh. It's very serious. One of my products ate a customer. Come again. A curse or a hex of some kind. I can't say. I'm unversed in magic. But somehow one of my devices has taken a taste for human flesh. 
I've burned the rest of the stock and a new shipment will arrive next week. But if I don't get this situation under control, my company will be ruined. You're asking me to kill a man-eating umbrella? <laughs> yes! Oh, Yathalin, help me. You must think I'm a crazy old crone. <laughs> I assure you, my faculties are all here. I have a theory that the Merchants Guild in Hatmandor, where the stock originates, is out to get me. They keep affiliations in the dark arts, those men, and they hate the fact that their precious industry has been breached by a woman. Please, check on my other customers. I'll pay you handsomely. This would be a first for me. Wonderful. Mr. Oro Av, the famous ornithologist, will be your first assignment. Please visit his home and make sure he's all right. Is there a special cause for concern? Did he buy one of the defective products? He's a regular customer. The other is Professor Heimer. Actually, perhaps you should check on him first. Of the two, he's the one more likely to get hurt in a fight. Chance of death. Mediocre pay. Helpless ingrates. Come in. Come find me in my shop when you've made your rounds. Visit Professor Heimer's house. Right, well, that's another episode because I'm trying to do this quest and get another quest springing up, but uh, that'll be the next episode. What did he have? This nuisance. Oh, just that. Okay. Well, at least he won't keep pestering me for money anymore. Anyway, so I'm doing Obsession, which is to talk to this one over here. Yeah, hi, the female help. Not now! My apologies, but I overheard your conversation with the archivist. So, you're an eavesdropper as well as a pest. I don't have time for this. May I have one of the scrolls you're looking for? Really? Why on earth do you have it? Somebody dropped it in the hallway. Please make sure it sees its way back to Master Kanan. I'll bring it to him right away. Thank you so much. Don't mention it. Talk to Ty Lin. Um, let's have a look. Oh, I'm so confused now of the quest. It's going all over the place. Car. Anyway, obsession. That's what I'm doing. Looks like I will deliver the warning to Professor Kynef. Whether knowledge or not, I should get my reward from Ty Lin. Right, let's head back to him. Tie up this quest finish it off and then start that next quest there's lots of quests in the town there it's fantastic oh great he's moved he's gone is he at his mother's house let's check the quest log and double click the quest That's an exclusive umbrellas. That's into the lion's mouth. But where is Tai Lin? He could be anywhere. Oh, obsession. He's in his house, of course, which is here. Yeah. Uh, having a moment. Do we have results? Canis' assistant has a scroll. Hopefully, he'll get the warning before it's too late. That's good news. Now, here's the bad. I've had another dream. There was an hourglass, and it's yours. <laughs> uh huh. Right. You're just trying to scare me. <laughs> I'm really not. Sorry. Say I buy this nonsense. How long do I have? Minutes. I would have told you sooner, but I had no way to reach you. I can't watch. Please understand. Force Thailand to stop the death clocks. Ooh. He's gone into this dungeon. Is he evil? Oh, skeletons. Oh, 
Ooh, getting out of health. Grand Chris, wow. Grand Necros, they give a ton of experience, so well cool, uh, let's loot them. And you can see I've got my carry weight up to 737 now. Oh look at that, Guru Sambok. Of course they're dropping better loot now, oh willpower 20%, nice. Yeah, much better loot. Yeah, nice Oculus. So there was four of them. Five of them. Let's see. Of course, you've got to be careful following him. That's Ty Lin, who's turning out to be the evil one. So he killed his own mother. Weird. Oh, I better save. I haven't saved in ages. to be somebody murdering your mother trying to kill me and one of your professors not to mention countless others you're a sad excuse for a person stop just stop it was Kanith that had you expelled wasn't it I don't know what you're talking about you thought saving his life would make him change his mind you're one sick individual die I'm gonna put a stop to this before it gets any worse Stay back. I'll kill you if I have to. With what? Magic that helped you flunk out of school? Go to hell, you big... You, you big, you... Whoa, <laughs> <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, crumbs. Right, back in a sec. Right, reloaded. That took me by surprise. I didn't expect that to happen, him to kill me like that. But it's because my creature's unspawned. Because it's a long... Mind you, we've gone through the story text. So this time I can skip the story text. Um... Try this again. Oh, whoops. They're in my way now. Come on, let me pass. There we go. Oh, God. Stop. I don't. Stay with Go there. Right, we've got just a few of my mates to take care of them. And that's how it should be done. Tailing this then. Your reputation with the Major's Guild increased. Cool. I can't believe that. All along he was evil. Oh, what's this? Life. Nice. Put another uh, bit on my healing. Another 100 points on my healing. Let's do that now. Magic staff. 
Hmm. Don't think it's as good as the one I've got that I'm using. There's my staff. Yeah, so I get willpower fifteen percent off of that, and my fire damage is four hundred and thirty-six. Yeah, so that's necromancy or something. Uh, so yeah, he was doing the hourglasses and killing people because he was bitter. Study of time. Let's have a look. What's that? Oh, so his ramblings about how he's killing people, maybe? There we go, for those of you that wanted to read that. And did I pick something else up? Right, if I check the quest log now, and yeah, the quest is gone. Well, hope you enjoyed this episode, and um, that's the obsession completed. Wherever you are in the world, God bless you and keep you safe. Thank you for watching, and have a fantastic day. In the next episode, we will do, I will do this other quest. I've just been given exclusive umbrellas. Goodbye.